Every week we're gonna give you a challenge. You're gonna have one week to prepare that challenge. So as we finish taping each night, the last thing we'll do is give you your next week's challenge. We really want you to use this to promote yourself, um, both for your own careers and for to advance yourself on the show. Now, while voting is not the be-all end-all on, on this, we do take it into account. Have thick skin about it, because it will happen at some point that uh, someone says, you suck, Jimmy. Oh, yeah. And we won't catch it on yeah. time. And Same and, shirt every week. And Jimmy will. <laughs> Same shirt. Yeah. <laughs> I'm myself to sleep. Right I'm going to have Ed take half of you down into the production studio, and you're going to read this line. Hi, I'm Blank from Project M, the Triple M reality show, and I am 105.5 Triple M. Do it with a little more enthusiasm than I just did. I'll hand Ed'll coach that you. to Ed. Um, and uh, so like five or six of you go, or four or five of you go with Ed, and the rest stay up here, and then we'll switch off halfway through. Oh, this wall? Musicians take their inspiration from different sources. Love, hate, politics, nature, girls, cars, and a whole lot more. Sometimes they don't find inspiration, but have it thrust upon them. Writing a song for a television or movie soundtrack, a commercial jingle would be an example of having the inspiration thrust upon you by someone else. For this first challenge, Kitty Dunn is thrusting her inspiration upon you. If you open up your CDs, you'll find the title of your first song, written by Kitty Dunn. You write a song to that title. You will also find a number on the CD. That's your number of performance next week. So that's your challenge for week one of Project M, the Triple M reality show. Good luck to everyone. Project M is thanks to Century House, U Square, Pizzeria Uno, Williamson Bicycle Works, Summerfest, Atlantic Records, and The Annex.